We know the timely exchange of health information between clinicians is key to providing better care for Canadians, and having modern technology in place can help. But knowing the plan to make this a reality is a different story altogether. It's about more than just entering patient information into a computer. It's about creating a network of different systems that can connect and share health information to authorized clinicians where and when needed, and eventually enable patients to view the relevant information they need within their record so they can work with their providers to better understand and manage their health. Sounds complex, doesn't it? Well, it is. It's an initiative that needs to be well thought out and done responsibly. With health information being of a very sensitive and private nature, this network of systems must respect all privacy laws. It also has to be designed and created so that it aligns with professional practice, regulations, and health policies, and that it evolves with our growing healthcare needs. So in the years to come, it will continue to benefit healthcare teams in Canada. With the provinces and territories, Canada Health InfoWay consulted healthcare providers and technology experts across the country to establish the foundational requirements for securely capturing, storing, sharing, accessing, and managing health information. Through this consultation, a plan was developed to guide the provinces and territories in building new and leveraging existing systems so they are compatible to connect regionally, provincially, and eventually across the country. With a standardized approach in place for Canada, the provinces and territories have the flexibility to create their networks according to the healthcare priorities in their regions, while contributing toward a greater goal, the day where every clinician has quick and easy access to accurate information when and where they need it. The plan calls for three fundamental components that all need to be in place to have a fully functioning electronic health record network within each province and territory. The three components are point-of-care systems, storage, and connection. The point-of-care systems component makes sure that all healthcare providers in Canada have compatible systems in place to send, retrieve, and manage critical health information within their individual practice settings. Currently, different locations, including community pharmacies, public health, primary care, acute care, long-term care, and home care, have different ways of managing information. Based on the systems they have now, some providers may be ready to connect to the electronic health record system right away. Some may have modern systems in place, but need add-on software to translate information to and from the network, or need new systems to be developed. The storage component has core databases being built by the provinces and territories. Each of these databases will store very specific clinical information that will be made available so clinicians can retrieve and contribute pertinent information when they are treating a patient. This is why these databases need to be compatible with each other and they need to be comprehensive, accurate and secure. The information stored includes unique information that identifies the right patient with the right health record, clinician information that securely links authorized healthcare providers to their patients, all diagnostic images like x-rays, MRIs, and CT scans, all laboratory work, all medications, and other clinical tests and reports such as hospital discharge summaries, allergy or immunization reports. The final component, connection, allows a complex variety of patient information to be quickly accessed and easily updated by authorized clinicians. Clinicians will see the most value in this component as it allows for the exchange of pertinent patient health information between clinicians at different locations who are caring for the same patient. Say, for example, you have a patient that's recovering from a stroke. All members of the healthcare team can contribute to ensure the patient's electronic health record is up to date. This will allow the team to view a patient's past history to provide the most appropriate acute care management, to conduct the best medication profile, and monitor any potential adverse drug reactions, to coordinate the overall stroke care protocol to provide specific patient education and arrange for in-home services, to understand the patient's in-hospital care and discharge treatment plans, while the patient can access their physiotherapy plan 
and complete their daily exercises. It'll allow all clinicians to collaborate with one another and provide patient-centered care. Sounds great, but how far have we come in making this collaborative network a reality? As complex as it appears, progress is already being made across the country. Different point-of-care systems are in development and have already been adopted by many clinicians across the country. Provincial storage databases are already in place in many parts of the country. And by 2016, the goal is to have all databases available for use across Canada. Connection, the most challenging component, is also now gaining momentum. It's about more than simply connecting facilities through technology. It requires an ongoing dialogue between practicing clinicians, healthcare leadership, and technology experts so the electronic exchange of information fits with clinical practice needs and aligns with required processes, regulations, and health policies. Working together, the provinces and territories and the healthcare community are on a transformational path, utilizing technological advancements to improve care for Canadians and continuously uncovering new and innovative approaches to electronic information sharing with healthcare providers. Clinicians today are already seeing some of the benefits of using health information technology to provide better, more informed treatment and care. While the journey is long, we are well on the way to making electronic health information systems available in every province and territory and providing all clinicians with the right tools to give the highest level of person-centered care possible to Canadians at the right time. Because knowing is better than not knowing.